Hey air signs, it's Adrizzy here, also known as the sweetest spiritual gangsta. I'm back with another message. So what we're going to get today for you is some messages from your person. Okay, the person you are dealing with. Okay, loosely dealing with, loosely involved with, all that. Okay, or this is the person, your person on your mind the most. So let's get some messages for them. If this video resonates at all, or if you just enjoy it, or if you like the cards, all that, anything, like and subscribe, okay? And also you can share this video to any other person of the same sign as you, or if it resonates for someone that you know, send it to them. Okay, but this will help my channel grow and it'll show other readers okay what they need to see coming up in their life okay but yeah let's get right into it okay for all air signs for my gemini libra and aquariuses what is the situation here in love for all of my air signs my air sign spirit guides can you show me what is the energy surrounding them in love right now? The person on their mind the most. What can you show me what this person might be feeling for, Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius? Show me their truth, please. Okay, we have don't worry, I'm coming back. So, you guys could be you guys could be separated for some uh from someone right now. Okay, but they want to say do not worry, they is coming back for that ass. Okay, they is coming back <laughs> for sure. Show me what else is here heart okay heart chakra love inner peace heart uh self-acceptance relationships fourth chakra some issues might be fearing of intimacy allergies asthma heart or lung so again if someone smokes just be aware of like cpod okay uh someone smokes weed or whatever try edibles a little bit but we have food here that you can eat as well broccoli kale and leafy greens okay Anything else here? Show me what their truth is. The person on Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius' mind. I can't help it that I'm toxic, baby. Okay, so we have two things here. Two purple. Okay, so this might be somebody not listening to their intuition about certain things, but maybe they are starting to. Okay, this person could be a little bit spiritual or intuitive. Okay, and they're not realizing it, but they're like, I can't help it that I'm toxic, but I'm coming back. I'm just trying to figure out some shit. Okay, <laughs> I feel like that's kind of the energy right now. Show me what else is here for the person on Gemini and a Libra and Aquarius's mind. Show me their truth. Truth. what do they want to say to gemini small feet okay so they think that do you evil either have small feet or this person could have small feet okay feminine or masculine energy however it resonates take it show me what else is their truth how does this person feel how does this person feel gemini libra and aquarius i'm done playing games with you so someone is definitely done playing games with you gemini libra or aquarius i feel like oh this wanted to fly out i think about you all the time yeah so this person really really is in your energy okay they're very um obsessed i'm not gonna lie i'm kind of getting that energy this could be some type of toxic connection that needs healing but it's like not please don't leave me oh so again you guys could be separate and someone's just like, wait, do not move on. Don't go nowhere. What are you doing? Okay, I can't help it that I'm toxic. I'm trying to change my, my ways. And I'm done playing with you. And I think about you. But don't leave yet. Okay, don't leave yet. I want to text you, but I'm not going to. Uh, some air, uh, who did they just do? Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. They really got these cards too. So you could be dealing with an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, especially with this red here. Okay, um what else is here again they're not listening to their intuition when it comes to their heart how they're truly feeling their inner peace okay they want to text you but they're not going to hot girl summer okay so you could be having a hot girl summer or this person might be okay show me what else is here or they feel like you're gonna go have a hot girl summer no orgasms yeah they feel like you're gonna go out and do your thing and they're gonna be left out in the dust left out in the cold <laughs> or they just haven't got any in a minute okay they're thinking of just some blocking you you might have this person blocked i don't know show me one more decision it is time to make a decision about this connection it is time it's time to decide about this connection so again you guys really really need to see what you want to do with this i guess okay show me one more big feet okay so someone has big feet someone has small feet so someone could be shorter than the other i don't know okay but overall energy is finances financial issues are a challenge in this connection or financial challenges are affecting this connection so i feel like someone okay they're not as um 
fortunate okay when it comes to money right now so i feel like that's why they're a little distant i feel like they want to maybe come in and uh either take you out or just do something special for you but they know they can't so it's like don't worry i'm coming back okay i'm trying to make some type of decision even with them being toxic they could be cheating or they could have another party somewhere you know what i mean all right um hold on give me one more i don't know why i started shuffling again but let's see top of the deck or in the middle of the deck wow both of this both parties are in a spiritual awaken, awakening Blech, i cannot talk but both people in this connection are going through a spiritual transformation so again i feel like a lot of people in this connection or whoever is in this connection really need to start healing okay they need to start figuring out what they want and i feel like they have started that but they know that they're still on toxic bullshit okay but again intuitively they know they know what the hell is good okay underneath that healing is i miss you but i don't have time right now again they miss you but they're not coming in forward one person is giving too much to this connection spiritual uh spiritual us uh, and spirituality underneath that so again i feel like someone needs to just start to do their healing um spiritually okay i feel like someone is just kind of toxic and all over the place do you love me the way i love you underneath that is white skin so someone could also have white skin that you are dealing with all right let's see what else is coming up for this connection show me some energy okay significant love relationship so this is definitely about a significant love relationship show me what else is here for all air signs old friends good memory so this is someone that you've known since childhood or maybe you guys just had a really strong friendship before you guys either started hooking up or before you guys started dating all right this is someone that you were old friends with but special knowledge and skills comes with this connection because i feel like it's a bit of a challenge it's a bit of a test okay this might be more of a lesson and not a blessing but i feel like if you guys wanted to have a commitment with one another you would really have to go through your special knowledge and skills okay to have this traditional relationship with this person underneath that again end of um end of a learning phase so i feel like again there's going to be some type of moment for you guys to come back together but only like if you guys let it solitude and meditation success and perseverance okay i feel like again someone's um they're meditating right now on how to get perseverance back with this connection okay moderation and self-control because i feel like maybe they did not have moderation and self-control again that i can't help it that i'm toxic baby talking about what like don't worry i'm coming back yeah i feel like they're trying to get themselves centered and balanced okay i feel like i'm getting like you know a, a bathroom hookup and it's like you're all disheveled and you're like kind of trying to like oh like you know try to fix your hair and shit i just feel like this person that's what this person's doing they're trying to get themselves back right from what they were just doing okay end of a learning cycle yeah but they this this cycle isn't done yet with this person okay because there's a few more lessons that need to be learned what is the energy coming up for oh that flew okay so actually two flew out so we have honeymoon enjoy the bliss holiday time together and heart to heart conversations so i feel like someone's definitely going to want to try to talk to you this person's going to want to try to talk to you get you alone kind of getting honeymoon vibes okay and i feel like it is best to maybe let go of trying to control the narrative of this situation trying to control things or the outcome okay let it be and get to know each other a little more because i feel like this could work there is maybe some love here but again there's a lot of games being played and i feel like um instead of just opening your heart fully get to know this person let go of trying to control things but also um just get to know them yeah because they are worth waiting for i feel like this connection can be something beautiful but for some reason um again there's some forgiving and learning that needs to go down again this could be someone that you are not with right now or again you guys are, might be in separation soon who knows Okay, let's see. What energy is the outcome of this connection? What is the energy of the outcome for this connection? Uh, for all Gemini, Libra, and Aquariuses, what is the outcome at the bottom of the deck? Walls down. Okay, again, taking your walls and putting them down. I feel like either you're going to be... Um, 
giving up on trying to fight for this because with the nine of wands this is the wounded warrior so this is someone that's like willing to fight for this in the upright okay they're tired but they're not giving up with this in the reverse i feel like you might be trying to give up on this connection but also you do have a little bit of fight with you and you want to let your walls down but again you're kind of tired like you don't want to keep these walls up you don't want to keep trying but also you love this person or you feel deeply about them okay yeah you want a brand new beginning with this person but you're kind of iffy all right you're very stuck in your head about it or you're going to be feeling that way okay we have the nine of wands and then the eight of wands again imprisoned in your own mind by your thoughts okay this could be a sagittarius as well with the temperance but i feel like you need to think about what's most best and balanced for you okay you need an equal give and take from this person okay or you just need to remain single with nine of pentacles here all right that is the result coming up um how does this person feel about you on a soul level what is the soul emotion okay how do they feel on a soul level about this person wow okay so they feel like the relationship is over they're scared okay that there's no more second chances that you're going to grow and transform your life without them something else filled up oh wow they really feel like they aren't enough um when it comes to this connection frustrated in relationship lacking confidence self-sabotaging fear jealousy ego issues okay and we have addicted underneath the deck so they are very obsessed stalkerish a little bit in your energy and they feel like this is over and i feel like they are also very sad because they do care about you but they know that they've been really um really inconsistent with you i feel okay yeah but there's a lot of love i swear there's a lot of love but they're a runner so you do have to really protect your heart when it comes to this person because there's always other competition there's always other people come competing for your energy okay and they know that or even competing for their energy and i feel like they're either running from that and they're trying to run in towards you and give you that love okay or this is them trying to choose whether or not they either want to keep toxic cycles you know what i mean um there could be someone toxic in the energy not even toxic but a third party you know show me what your angels might have oh actually give me three cards of what's coming up three cards of what's coming up show me their truth for all gemini libra and aquarius is true gem so this person is going to find you as a true gem, okay? And they're going to try to start treating you like it because they know what they have or they're seeing what they have now that you guys are alone. Ooh, show me what else is here. Show me what else is here. Ice King. Okay, this could be a Leo, okay? Coming back in your energy, someone that was very icy, very cold. This could be some type of businessman, someone that likes a sense of control, okay? But they're definitely coming in. A little icy, a little very practical, kind of coldish, you know? Yeah, but this is a past life connection. So I feel like there is this connection is a bit on a loop because you guys have been each other with each other in a past life. And I feel like you guys just can't get it right. So you guys just keep coming back to each other, keep coming back to each other. And I feel like it's time to just make some type of decision. Yeah, some texting, some form of type of communication is going to be coming in. Okay, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius is. What do your angels have for this connection? What is some advice from your angels? What is some advice from your angels about this connection? Show me some truth. Okay. There's an opportunity coming in. Definitely some type of opportunity and it's going to be up to you. Okay. Show me what else. This opportunity is all up to you. The ball is in your court. Okay. Basically some self-care is get a health checkup as well. Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius says, I don't know why this is here, but I feel like it might be necessary for you to get a health checkup. Show me what else is here. Okay. We have yes. Keep that balance. I feel like this opportunity is going to be up to you. Whatever you choose. Okay. No at the bottom of the deck. Forgiveness. Again, you might have to forgive this person and you might not want to, but I feel like for you to get progress within this connection, you do need to forgive and forget. Okay. Don't stop forgiving and don't stop forgetting, but I feel like, or don't stop forgiving, but don't stop forgetting. Okay. Compromise in this situation, or you can just leave it alone. But I feel like in the near future, you're going to have to compromise to keep something balanced. Okay, what is some advice? What is some advice? What is some advice? Oh, wait, hold on. Let me get these first. What is some advice, some rude advice for this connection for all Geminis? What is the truth that they need to see? It's dark and you can't see a fucking thing. Get your head out of your ass pronto. <laughs> all right, anything else here? It's not everyone else's fault. It's yours. Stop. Uh, you are a grown ass adult. Stop blaming others for your shit. 
Give me one more. Okay. What the hell are you waiting for? Get that shit done. If you're waiting for a sign, well, here it fucking is. So I don't know if you've been, okay, at the top of the deck, time to let go move the fuck on so i feel like again this person might be a little too toxic for you to keep around i'm not gonna lie so i feel like it is time for you to move on to let this go i feel like you're a little sad that shit is not working out but this might be a little bit of your fault okay so i feel like just be aware of that and you need to let go if you want to show me one card for the outcome what is coming up what can they expect all gemini libras and aquariuses your commitment is being tested. Your commitment to this person, again, intuition with this purple, okay? But I feel like with the first quarter moon here, your commitment is being tested with this person, with the situation. Are you going to stay committed to this? Underneath that, expect powerful change. So again, someone's coming back, okay? And there might be some type of change, but I don't know if it's going to be the change that you want. But I hope that helps in some type of way. Okay, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. Um, if you do like this, please thumbs up and subscribe. But yeah, I'll be back soon with another message. Bye-bye. Be safe, guys.